Who was writing who? Who was writing this poem? Me? No. The writer of the first word, not the writer of the last. With the terror of the light and the shadows cast, the third eye now open. To project the night, this is the moment to write. This is the ritual to lead you on. Your friends will meet him when you are gone. Pretty spooky. Very spooky! Uh-oh. Echo time. Come on. I oh. felt stepping to the murder site. I'd felt it hanging in the air. A meaning. The violent emotion of the act. Like a cloud of wrath. The dead eyes of the victim staring at something you couldn't see, and yet making you aware of it. Something that soaked into this place on a molecular level, overlapping with your meaningless existence. Wow. Regression to something you had managed to forget. Marking you. Taking you for a ride. Making you crazier. Eyebrow raise. Love the actor that they got for him that they did the facial capture for. It looks great. Very handsome man with very defining features. Hello? Alan Wake, writer, detective. Man with a gun and a flashlight. I am very well equipped. Hell. Oh. Hey, we're. Back on the platform. What are we looking up for? Oh, there we go. Hello, words. Have I gotten these words before? Where am I? Where am I? Yeah, I've gotten this words. Oh, we're all... Wait, we're back here now? Oh, my lord. My brain. Oh, we've been here. Oh, this is this door. Oh, God. Clever game design. Putting me back at the start. How dare you. That was good. I liked that a lot. Oh, the frame rate. The station had changed. I was closer now. What does that mean, Alan? Are we... Get to the... Oh, that's right. Parliament Tower. That's right. There it is. Parliament Tower. Our home in New York. Was I really this close to being home? Going up to our apartment? Would I be home? What is or home, Alan? just an echo of the real thing. What is home? Even then, the murder site had brought me one step closer to escape. Is that me? Wait. Payphone's ringing again. I'm coming! The payphone at the edge of the plaza was ringing again. Hello? Hey, Alan. Thank God he picked up. I thought I lost you again. Who are you? Why are you helping me? Did you go deeper? To the Oval app? Are you talking about the murder site? Yeah, I, I did. I, I... That's fantastic, Alan. We're closer to getting out. We're making progress. Well, we would be if you would answer my damn questions. Answer my questions! Last time we spoke, you were pretty worried about Alice. Did you ever check Parliament Tower? To make sure she really got out of the dark place? Well, of course she got out. That's why I'm here. That's the whole goddamn point. Be very careful, Alan. The dark presence is stealing from you. It can already manifest as your double. Scratch will come. Ah. Yes. Wait, wait, hello? Mr. Scratch. Shadunk. That was a chunky setting down of the phone. Ah. Koba. Hello? There's no need for such rampant whisperings. No thank you. No thank you indeed. I'm missing anything, am I? No. Okay. Into Parliament Tower we go. Uh, yes, let me just open that sliding door. 
That's me. He was a victim. The cult using his words. Or maybe he was the monster behind it all. Either way, Alice Wake, his ex, she knew things. It was there in her art for all to see. A cry for help. The darkness she'd witnessed. And that put her in danger. Was Alice here? In the story? The person we were looking for the whole first game? This is a pretty nice first floor. Oh, of course it's red. Why wouldn't it be red? Oh, good. I'm sure this can only end well. Elevators and extra dimensional spaces go hand in hand. I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Stop it with the jump scares. Haunting. Okay. This photo equipment set to go off when the door opens. Didn't even give me time to put on a good face. Yes! Uh, Leave me alone! Alice! Alice! Alice? How many closets do we have? Lord. Alice. Pick photos for exhibition posters. This is a photo of Scratch. Sure is. How did Alice get this? I mean... She's stalking her. She's got a lot of spookies. Here she is. Hello? This is the door to my study. Why's it got Where the swirl on it? This hmm. symbol wasn't here before. No, indeed. Holy crap! Your guys' apartment is huge! This isn't an apartment, this is just a house. In the middle of a bunch of other houses, holy crappity. Oh, photo, uh, video camera? Alice's video camera. I need a memory no card. memory card inside. Okay. What this? Video art doc on screens, MULT, focal point of the dark place. What were you, what were you snacking on here? Okay. Like your kitchen. Real nice kitchen. Is that the refrigerator? This thing? Is this the fridge? Huh. Okay. Got a coffee pot. You gotta be able to make coffee. It's nice. It's like a coffee pot that would go in a diner. Okay. Okay. Part one. Alice's memory card. Okay. Okay. Is that a 64? I can't, I want to know if that's bigger than, I think it's a 64 meg, but I could be wrong. Back in the, the younger days of video camera. <laughs> Small SD cards. When I was younger, photography was everything to me. I moved to New York thinking I'd make it as an artist. And then I met Alan. That's me. We had a good thing. We were both dedicated by our creative ambitions. Oh. The only difference was that Alan's work made money. Oof. He brought me work when he could. I took his promo shots, um, created covers for his books. I'm sure he forced his publisher into it. Oh. I was taking photos, just not my photos. And that gnawed at me. Things got complicated sometimes, but that's life, right? Good advice. We loved each other. Then, uh, Alan hit a block. I brought out a meaner side of him. One I didn't like. I set up a trip to see a doctor in Washington. 
Washington. I didn't tell him until we got there. We argued. Things went wrong. Mm hmm And he was just gone. Drowned, allegedly. Easy for people to think it was my fault. Hell, I do, too, sometimes. About six years ago, I started hearing noises in the night. Typewriter keys clacking. Voices. Alan was back. Haunting me. Oh, the light flash. It was my doppelganger. He always did have anger in him. I set up cameras around the apartment with motion sensors and flashes. Now, when the monster comes, I turn it into art. My nightmares caught on film. And this is the focus of my new exhibition. To show people the world is so much darker than they ever knew. I'm calling this exhibit the dark place. Uh, so coincidental. Alice. Scratch was terrorizing her. Huh. Why? Because he's a pizza, dude. He's a pizza shit. Oh. God. Live action scenes are so good. I sat in the writer's room and wrote a story. Initiation. To project myself through the dark place. To look for a way out. The story had brought me here, brought me nowhere. Loop me back. I was writing this story. And in the story, I now stepped into the writer's room. But there was no one here writing. But then who was phone? Not looking so good there, Alan. Scratch. It's what bugs see in a Dyson. Oh, no synchronized coffee drink. Okay, let's recap what you've told us so far, Ellen. For the past 13 years, you've been trapped in a nightmare dimension called the Dark Place. Yeah. It's like New York, but it's not New York. And can be reached from the bottom of Cauldron Lake, but it's not really under the lake. And after all this time, you've managed to get out. Yeah, yeah. But so has your evil doppelganger. Mr. Scratch? Or is it the Dark Presence? Both. It's interchangeable. He's Scratch when he looks like me, but he can change into this other form. And Scratch, the Dark Presence, wants to rewrite the world in his own image. Which would be in your image as he looks just like you. And turn the world into a fucking nightmare. 
during Deerfest. An American Nightmare? Which is scheduled to take place in a couple of days. You got out of the dark place by writing a novel, the pages we've been finding. But your double edited it into a horror story that's now changing reality, taking over people, yeah. making them crazy, bringing the dark place to Bright Falls. Yes, fiction coming in contact with the dark place can change reality. The story is coming true, soaking into everything, like, like, like darkness when, it, when night falls. But last time... It... This will be back in 2010. Yes, last time it didn't happen all at once. The story came true bit by bit as it unfolded. And that dark presence was still bound to the lake. I stopped it before it got the ending it wanted. Mm -hmm. Before it broke free. Based on that, there's still time. Which brings us to your magical life. The clicker. Magical doesn't quite cover it. Scratch wants it to bring about his ending. That, that can't happen. If I can get the clicker, I, I can send him back to the dark place, make all the shit go away. <sighs> Look, I know it's batshit crazy. A little. My memory is it's full of holes, and I, I'm not sure how much I can trust. It, it's like it's like it's like a half-forgotten dream. Alan has very full eyelashes. I'm very impressed. There's the synchronized drink. Yeah, <laughs> I love it. It's so good. Oh. Mr. Wake, Alan. We've seen our share of batshit crazy in the past 24 <coughs> hours. <coughs> what I want to know is, why am I? Why are we written into the story? I think I saw you. Or a vision of you in the dark place. Thanks, Nightbot. I think you helped me reach out and escape somehow. With that in the story, Scratch would have edited it to get to you. To hurt you. We are all in danger. Yes, Sparks, this is Unreal Engine, I believe. And bam, right into it. Gameplay. It's insane. And there's so much of it. Uh, what are we doing right now? Learn more about the clicker. All right. Oh, we got a bunch of case files. I guess let's put up our Alan Wake interview. Wake just gave us a lot of information, but this clicker seems like a good place to start. If we find that, then we find the cult. Yep. Get my Charlie Day board going on out here. Can't say I understand all this, but if Wake is telling the truth, then this magical light switch is the most tangible lead. Let's start there. Where is the clicker? The pages we've been finding are from a horror story called Return, written by Alan Wake, and the contents of this book are coming true. Why couldn't it have been a romance? Because that wouldn't have been as, you know, endearing saga, let's be real. Uh, the dark place. The dork place! I don't have the clue for that yet. Okay. Or the linking clue. Okay. Let's stick more things up here. Case closed. Nightingale goes missing for 13 years, shows up murdered, <clears throat> and then turns into a monster. After I stop Nightingale... <sighs> A rider who's also been missing for 13 years turns up. What's the connection? What kind of case is this? A very difficult one. I killed Nightingale. I had to. He was a monster. The flooding around Cauldron Lake receded afterwards. Nothing about this makes rational sense. We found Alan Wake, a rider missing for 13 years at the shore of the lake. Hopefully he can shed some light on this. Have you ever heard of the Cult of the Tree? Creepy bunch in the habit of wearing deer masks, performing murder rituals, victims turning into monsters possessed by darkness, possibly inspired by a horror story written by a certain author. Hmm? Ring any bells? The cult? Yes. 
Yes, they have the clicker. Well, that's good to know. If the cult has the clicker, does that make them Scratch's followers? How are you so certain they even have the clicker? They could be working for Scratch. I don't remember. It's all confused. Alan, if I'm going to act on this information, you need to be honest with me. Yeah, of course. Is he confused? Or is he hiding something? Hmm. <gasps> we can profile Alan. Oh, hell yes. Give me the spookiness. The cult and the clicker. Wake said the cult has the clicker. How does he know? The writer is the reader. The next chapter. The next chapter. The next chapter. Keep the pages safe, the dark shining of the words. Wake is hiding pages. That's how he knows the cult has the clicker. Scratch. Wake has a double. Mr. Scratch. Where is he now? A cloud of wrath wears my face. The dark place in your place. Scratching out my body of work. Scratch is here. In Washington. He's hunting Wake. Well, no surprise there. Scratch looks just like Wake. Why? Don't wake up the dreamer if your life is a dream. I swam to the shore, but the water is rising. Wake and Scratch are clearly connected. Maybe Scratch got out because Wake did. Or vice versa. Yeah, probably. Very probably, actually. Okay, Mr. Wake. I know you have more pages of the manuscript on you. You don't understand how vital these pages are. They're the only way I can know what's coming. You're not the only one trying to solve this. This is our job. Okay. Here. Now, this is all I have. Be careful with them. Inside the trailer, at the outskirts of Watery, Saga had seen Wake's fabled clicker for the first time in the hands of the cult of the tree. A cultist stared at her. She drew her weapon. Okay then. Sure are. It's all on the page. The clicker, the cult. Okay, I'll head to Watery and find this trailer. Casey, you stay here and keep an eye on Mr. Wake. Got it. No, you need me there. No dice, pal. This is an FBI investigation, and I don't see a badge on that flannel. What? Did you just judge Alan's choice of flannel? He looked amazing in American Nightmare. Don't, don't even. Now when you can switch between Alan and Saga stories via the bucket in the Jander's break room. Oh, well, hold on. Oh. Switch reality. Ooh. All right. Interesting. So if I do this, I can just... Oh. I was back. I wasn't able to escape. A dark presence had stopped me. Ah, okay. Interesting. <laughs> very, very interesting. I'd seen the title page of another manuscript. Return. I didn't remember writing it, but it felt familiar. Important. I had to find it. The plot board was oh. empty again. I needed a new draft back at the beginning, but closer to my goal. And to switch realities, do we just go to the typewriter and write ourselves back to... I would write a new draft oh, of no, this is just starting. to reach okay, Parliament no, Tower using another murder site. Scratch was reaching out from the dark place to get Alice. She was out, but still in danger. Tonight is Alan Wake. 
This time we wanted to do something. I was back, and I hadn't forgotten. I knew how this worked now. I could take control, no more surprises. What demons he wrestles with in the dark hours of the night. Okay. Together with our house band, the divine old gods of Asgard, we have created something very special. The song is called Herald of Darkness, but I like to call this next segment the story of the journey of Alan Wake, the musical. Oh my god, Casey, Just what is happening there? <laughs> we'll chat, but instead of talking, we'll sing it. Oh no, wait a minute. <laughs> Yeah, Alan, that's also my my expression right now. <laughs> this shit's about to become a musical. Oh, God. It was locked from the other side. And here I can switch back to Saga. Okay. Wait, is that Ati and the Janitors? Oh, my God, yes. We gotta run into Ati some more. I love that man. I need his extremely, uh, finished advice. Alright. Well, you know what? I'm down for more Alan Wake crazy. Let's, let's keep going with Alan. Look at that well-groomed beard. My god. Oh, oh. <laughs> hell yeah. What the hell? From what I gathered, you grew up nice and sheltered with oh, those pretty my stories. God, yes. You all made up fury. And Mama gave me a magic clicker. Well, yes, I think it's true and fair to say. Come on, Ham. Oh, my God, yes. <laughs> I don't know what's happening, but I love it. Please, handsome gentlemen. Yeah? What's going on there, Ellen? Come on in the near sand, lost words you give me a sin. Now the fire you're bearing, the eye of the darkness, your So far, this is very MTV. Love your guys' moves. Pretty swag. had to do all of it. Like, this is wonderful. <laughs> it's great. Oh my god, look at those moves, Alan! Alan Wing 2 Electric Boogaloo! <laughs> yeah! Oh 
my god, Mr. Door with the fucking moves! My god, this is amazing. <laughs> I can stay here forever and be very happy. <laughs> Please don't let me interrupt the lead. I don't know. Happy to let that keep going. There's the audio quality. Oh, yeah. I love this dance, too. <laughs> it's wonderful. Need to learn this dance and do it, at, you know parties in VR or something. Alright, this is this has gone on quite long, I love it. But my god. I love it. That was uh a masterpiece. That was art. But we're not done. And the award goes to Stories of crime and chilling thrillers of hard boiled killers became bestsellers. It was all too much, I had to get away. I see we're just in verse two now. All right. So we got our, uh, our light back. I'm very okay if this whole episode, this whole section is just all musical. No, no, Alan. So dramatic. In not quite New York. Thank you. I will go this way. Oh, there's my light. Thank goodness. Oh, oh and the gun. Oh, thank goodness. Well, that means shit can get real now. Look at that jawline on that guy. Damn. You can support a building with that jawline. That is just an empty void, okay. God, this is like actually amazing. I love this so much. <laughs> Damn, those shades look great, Alan. The Getaway Club. Fire in the 
That's definitely opposed to the Paul Singer. Breaking my brain. Good lord. Okay, so I'm ready to fight. <gasps> Look, Mom, I'm on TV. My face when my life becomes a musical. Welcome to Bright Falls. Oh, somber overture. She could write a story like Tom Zane before him, and maybe they'd be happy once again. Just one shot, one more chance for him to save their marriage away from the city. Oh, the whole scene is moving. Oh, God, I didn't even notice that. Flashlight. Ah, Deerfest. Look at the smolder on this guy. Damn. Hmm. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> It's my writer's room with the sick dance. Hell yeah. <gasps> the flare gun. Yes, finally. Hell yeah. Oh, that means. Checking behind everything in case they've hidden things. I almost just don't want to talk this whole time. It's so good. I'm just I'm just enjoying myself. I forgot what dodge is on controller, guys. Oh, I don't. I literally don't remember. <laughs> I actually did not remember what the fuck dodge button is. Alright. Why don't we try using the flare gun just to see how she do. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, you. Bah! Oh, shit. Hey, oh! 
Ma'am, your face is off. Like that movie, Face Off. God, this riff is so sick. I love it. Red truck. Oh, uh, hey there. Hey, sir. Where the hell's your weak spot? Ah, uh, batteries and health. Good. Appreciate your game, giving me stuff. Yeah, how many flare shots do I have? Oh, we've got a lot of flare shots. Make sure to have that ready, ready to go. Anyone in the Porta John? Oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, ho, 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 baby. Oh, Alan, I need you to reload faster, bud. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Um, how do I... That's that. That's that. Whoops. Uh, triangle. I really need to quick slot this up. Hey, whoa, 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 hey, 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 whoa. Shit. Shit, ki buzz. Ma'am, stay back. I'm warning you. I warned you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> enemies. Thank goodness they told me where they would be. We got some flares. Definitely assign those. Looks like that into the up. Ah, uh, di diver's eye. Oh, oh. oh, hey, whoa, whoa, hey, whoa, whoa, hey, whoa, whoa, guy, whoa, whoa, guy, whoa, guy. Whoa, wee, 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 blah. Jesus. Whoa. Bop, bop. Jesus. Ooh. Finish reloading, Alan. There we go. That man is stuck in the stairs. I'm sure he'll be fine, though. Oh, that's not stairs, Dre. Oh, golly. Pretty much what this whole section is, Kaji. Oh my god. My brain's having a wonderful overload of music right now. Oh, good. A moment of calm. And then right back to the action. I didn't miss any bullets or anything back here, did I? Because I am pretty close to running out of those now. Okay. Oh, thank God, a TV. I'm not doing anything with the typewriter. Just... Um...
Are we okay now? <sighs> Back in the studio. I, <laughs> I love how much of a mind fuck this is, yeah. It's so good. Ah, oh, it's wonderful. Okay. I didn't see that coming. <laughs> Hell yeah, you didn't. Neither did I, Alan. But boy, am I happy that it happened. Oh my god. A vision. A vision? Oh. Alignment. Oh. Oh, well. Uh, huh? Hey, wait. Uh, what? Oh my god. Such a dark place. Am I trapped in here? Jimmy, take the base for a walk. Surrender to Echo seems to seek out Again and again Until I figure it out To bring this song to its end Ooh, Ooh. Alan! The moves! Mm. Ooh God damn. <laughs> oh, they just had so much fun doing these fucking sections. <laughs> you have to find your way out to bring this song to its end. Keep the symbols splashy, Tommy. Got the musical. Gotcha. Oh, the song's end. Oh. I was trapped in an old guys of Asgard musical, reliving the trauma in my nightmare filled childhood. Trapped in the musical, I returned to the, excuse me, subtitle. Returned to the events that led me here, facing the dark presence of Bright Falls 2010 with Alice. Trapped in the musical, forced to face my issues and failings, unable to cope with my seemingly perfect success story. I struggled to find a way out of the musical to continue my journey through the dark place. But what if we just wrote. And it's a oh hell yeah VCR. Oh my god, the four by three ratio. <laughs> Wait a minute, <laughs> the black bars on the sides. <laughs> oh my god, yes. No, don't you dare. Fuck yes! <laughs> the permanent scream. <laughs> so good. You did it, Alan. You escaped the musical. Good job, bud. And I thought this place couldn't get any stranger. You sent the flare gun away? Oh, God. <gasps> Buddy. <laughs> Who knew there was a whole musical number in a game? That was wonderful. I just might take Game of the Year slot for me just because of that. That was just so well done. And also this man. Catchy, right? Why are you mopping a rug? Ati, this is not a moppable surface. That's... You're gonna ruin the rug, my man. Hi, <laughs> Swedish brothers, Perkel. Hi, 
I wish I knew that language. It's Finnish, I believe. I love that the subtitles are just like, yep, here's the words. Good luck, you don't know this language. <laughs> Definitely A+, plus, one of my favorite characters from Control. So happy to see him here. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else for me to find in here? Or are we just leaving? I think we're just leaving. Oh, God. Why would the end of a section scare me? 